something section for uh, my candles. check this next spot. I found a ton of Ulta makeup there last night. So we'll go. Hey guys, look what I just rolled up on. Just sitting in the road here. This basket. And this basket. And a coffee maker. This basket. And this big basket. A chemistry book. But look at this. Oh, I thought that might. I thought that was still a tag. But look at these baskets just sitting here in the road. Oh, a black organizer's cute. All right, I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do here. I'll show you guys when I get home.
sweet. Okay, I'm gonna be careful. And hopefully I find them all. There's the scissors. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. So here's the block, and there. Now I just need to get out of here. All right, guys, I'll see you in a minute. some stuff but I forgot my flashlight. I have to go back in the car to get it. But I found some cute stuff. Oh, look at the little necklace. Let's 
see this can all go to the children's hospital. I'm so excited. Hey guys, so if you saw in the one clip, there was that uh, wicker basket stuff and um, this item that was in the alley um, behind the dumpsters. So people, you know, or by the dumpsters, people leave that stuff for people to take. So I just took what I liked and that was this, this is pretty cool. It's really nice. It has this um, nice little handle here so you can carry it but you know for napkins silverware for entertaining whatnot um, I did leave the rest of the stuff and again I'm going to reiterate that I don't take everything I live in a very big city of Denver Colorado I am NOT the only diver and I'm not a selfish diver yes I do take what I want and I leave the rest and trust me the stuff won't be there when I go there the next day um, so with that said I take what I want and that was this and um, then, as you've seen, I've been getting a lot of candles lately. So awesome. And I have this really cool cabinet right here. And that's where right now I'm storing all my candles. Um, but yeah. So, and then you guys saw that Ulta, I grabbed that bag. And I went there the day before and found another bag of stuff. And this was everything that I found. And it was all wrapped perfectly in the plastic wrap sealed and so when I got home I started opening everything and you guys like this didn't have a lid on it but it was wrapped in plastic and it you can tell was not used at all the only reason for those imper imperfections is because my little grabby thingy was poking at it um, but regardless of that uh, like this had the little plastic seal on it as it was never opened so that was really nice uh right here this clinique um the tart concealer this other smashbox concealer all of this is looks completely full so not sure on that um this right here Too faced natural eyes um that was here, open that um as you can see it was just broke and it fell out but the others you can tell were have never been used brand new and that is so pretty I um, love their palettes um, these lipsticks were brand new but I did wipe them down just in case because anybody can open it and cough or sneeze anything so I still wiped them all down but brand new um, 
Then these right here, you guys, brand new. And here's how I can tell you how it's brand new. Because, look right there. There is no product in the little hole there. They were completely brand new. I was just so excited, like, wow. I don't know. I don't know why they're throwing away brand new product. Um, then here was some, I think this is Lancome, some perfume. These were two really nice products by Juice Beauty. Uh, I priced these out. They were like in the $60 range, and they're, they're pretty full. Um, but, yeah, clean those up, and I will definitely use those. This was some Anastasia product. I opened it completely unused. Um, it's some type of eyeliner, liquid eyeliner. All right, and then we'll go through this quickly, but just some foundations here. Clinique. This is was really expensive, this Clarins, and that was pretty much full. This is a Derma Blend, another Clinique, and this one was used, but I did clean it up with alcohol. And But yeah, you guys, all of that makeup, that was, you know, this stuff is very expensive makeup. Um, so, yep, all right, let me set up for the next next clip guys okay guys so here was the Kong that I found um, and then was it another pet uh, smart and I scored this inflatable collar uh, dog muzzle and some fish stuff there and then the bowl um, no cracks or anything nothing was wrong with it there was one with it was broke but anyway so yeah I'm gonna be donating as much of all of that that I can um, and then this was the little sweatshirt, the little dog sweatshirt. It says, let's walk on the wild side. So cute. And it's just uh, won't fit Winston and it won't fit Champ. But again, I'm going to donate all the dog stuff. Um, I did stop at CVS and this was the only two things that I found. So um, no big deal on that. All right. So you guys, this is what I got at bed bath and beyond um it was by chicago cuttery and i looked this up you guys and it's a hundred and fifty dollars hundred and fifty dollars this is so nice it has the sharpener right there um i've needed i've been wanting one of these i had one for a long time and obviously it was just really old and threw it away um but yeah so that was an awesome awesome find so excited and the best part about it they spray painted the very bottom of the wood block so they didn't damage anything else and this i threw all of the silverware in the wash uh dishwasher and just took it out and everything is clean and ready to go on my kitchen counter so all right and then you guys look at look at look at so you saw these um that I found at Bed Bath and Beyond and I just used a little heat and I fixed them right up and it has a little fox now there's these little bunnies um and their ears are snapped off so I'm going to go over to Hobby Lobby find something that I can um fix those with because these candle holders at Bed Bath and Beyond are like outrageously priced and yeah, I'm definitely going to fix them. So those turned out so perfect. I normally don't open the trash bags at Bed Bath & Beyond, but you better believe, I'm sorry, at Bath & Body Works, but you better believe I'm going to now. I am going to check everything um, because these almost ended up in the landfill and that would have been just too sad. All right, um, I did peek at Party City. These were just a couple little things, these little coloring notepads and these little pens, um, which all of this stuff I'm getting ready to show you is going in the children's hospital box. And that is definitely my daughter and I are going this week. We've been putting this big box together and we're going to film it too. Um, so we're, we're really excited about that. Um, so this is all going in that children's hospital donation. These little wings, this little Disney princess wand, can you believe all this stuff they're throwing away, all these little headbands um, at the Party City Dumpster? Uh, I don't think I'm going to be donating that in the Children's Hospital. That might be a little too scary. But, uh, yeah, these cute little spider earrings and necklace and the little donut and then those little socks. 
Then there was this like, probably for a costume, uh, for, uh, you know, what's her darn name? Um, Dorothy. <laughs> I'm like, Heather, pull it out of your head. It's right there. But yeah, she put little Toto in there. Uh, the little for the costume, but that little basket is cute. So anyways, yep, that will all be donated and we still have uh, more here to show you. So let me set that up. All right. So here is the rest of everything. Um, as you've seen in the clip, I found these disco balls. I'm telling you guys, all of the little packaging, everything was unopened as far as the stuff. Um, I'm not sure why they were in the dumpster, but um, I have the second box. It's still in my car, but yeah, scored both of those. My daughter is so excited. She wants one in her room. Um, so yeah, she's getting one of those. Um, and then I did find, uh, you know, sometimes I find stuff, guys, when I'm just out running errands, and I'm not filming. And then I'm like, oh, let me check this. And then I find some things so I don't have a clip for it. But um, I did find these caramel and sea salt uh, Belgian dark chocolate spread. That looks really good. Um, and then I did find a little dog harness at uh, PetSmart. Um, these were some little earrings at Burlington. And then I was at Five Below and there was just a little candle, a USB laser light, and then um, those salt lamps, if I'm saying that right. My daughter has one in her room, but um, it was just the, the rocks, but yeah. So anyways, um, and then the rest of the party city, uh, they had this Joe Biden mask. That was funny. Uh, that was on the day. I found that on the day of the actually election. Um, this I scored at five below, and this is going into the children's uh, hospital box. And then um, these plates unopened, nothing wrong, 40 of them. And then from uh, this was also what I found at Party City, and it just said there's some missing parts, but I haven't opened it yet, but yeah. Then uh, um, I was by Michael's, and honestly, you guys, I've been checking that area and not finding anything lately, so I've been being a little persistent because with Halloween over, I was curious to see if they're going to throw anything away, but um, they did finally. This was the only thing. But look at these guys, light up foam gliders, and ho look how many of them. So this is going to be so nice um, to donate. I'm really excited to add this to the donation pile. But yeah, scored all of those. Um, and then the other, when I found um, that knife set at Bed Bath & Beyond, I also scored this thing, uh, those little collapsible containers which is nice because I have put a storage unit together of everything organized and um, I really needed some more storage containers so yeah that was a nice one um, they, just a few little spots but they didn't damage it other than that and then real quick I'm just gonna set this here um, a few videos ago, you guys, um, I forgot to show you this. You've seen it in the clip, but I found these dog uh, food storage containers. And the lids did fit perfect. And everything was totally fine. And it has little wheels. I um, already have one. And I did find two of these. So I did give one to my neighbor. And uh, she, she said she could use it. And then I'll see if I can donate this one with all the other pet stuff I've been putting together. But yep, but that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for stopping by my video. Um, I am just so appreciative. We are currently, I'm at um, like 20 subscribers away from 1,000. Maybe when I post this, I will be at 1,000. But uh, thank you guys again for everything and your support. If you enjoyed the video, please give this a thumbs up. And if you're new, hit the subscribe and notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. All right, guys, uh, stay tuned. I have an awesome another video coming um, from this past uh, weekend. All right, guys, have a good day.